Hello, I'm Lynette Chandler from Thrive Anywhere. Today's video, I am going to talk about using ChatGPT to edit one of our workbooks. Ready? Let's go. My browser is a browser called Wavebox. It has this feature called Brainbox here, which is an AI engine built right inside. You can use ChatGPT if you want to for this purpose, but I'm just showing it to you here just so we can see everything on one screen. For the sake of saving time, all I'm going to do in this video is editing the text. I'm not changing any graphics or anything like that. We have the title here, Homeschool Startup Workbook. I will type in my AI bot here. This is the prompt that I'm using. You can use anything you want. I'm going to hit enter. So it's much longer than I want to, but I can do that too. If I don't like that, I will ask it again. And this time, maybe I just remove that part and we'll see what it comes up with. Okay, we can do that. So here, what we're going to do is copy this and replace this here. Now, of course, this is longer. I have to move it up here and I probably need to change the line spacing. Move it down here. I change, move this a little further down and I'm going to copy the second part right here. And I'm just going to split it that way. And if I want to, I think it's a little crowded here and I want to make sure all my images and things are inside the uh, purple box that you see there. That's your margin. I may have to resize this just a little bit. Next thing I'll do is I go to the next page. Again, I'm gonna, I want something different other than objectives. Now that's pretty easy. So I can say goals or whatever. It's really nice with Canva because in Canva, it has the magic write feature. So click on the box with the text that you want to edit and click on this Canva assistant and it will ask you what you want to do. Now you can summarize this. Homeschooling is a great option for customization of learning styles. Okay, that can be good. Or you can, I don't want to expand because it's pretty long already. I can do rewrite and it might rewrite this. And because it's a little too long, I can go ahead and do again and summarize text. And make sure, always, always, always make sure to read anything that the AI gives you because you want to make sure that it's sound. Also, a lot of times AI writing gives you very shallow content. After you use it a few times, you know what I mean by shallow content. Um, everything is just very top level, surface level information. As an expert, if you are creating this workbook for your clients, for your customers, and you are the expert in this field, always inject your own expertise in this. So we're going to read this. This is pretty simple and straightforward. I don't think it needs any kind of expert information injected in it. I'm going to take it, right? And now I'm just moving this, changing it up. And even these questions, I can ask it to rewrite. Okay, that works again. Rewrite and that works. So already very quickly, you can see how you can change the questions and even the content of this workbook super quickly. And I've showed you how to use it with any AI engine that you want or using the Canva assist option here. If you like this video, please click on the like button and also be sure to subscribe to this channel for more. Thank you so much for watching. Be sure to visit thriveanywhere.com freebies to grab a template for yourself.